Holy. All right, welcome back everyone. Ryder Tweedy here. And in today's video, we're going to be using the little Mavic Air 2 to active track myself on the scooter, on the little moped. So um, we're gonna see how this goes. I'm gonna switch to a screen recording when we do take off and start flying, but we'll do a few little tests. We'll probably, we'll track around here. Um, we might do a low track as well and we'll chuck it in its fast tracking mode when it's up high and see if that changes every, anything. But we'll just, we'll just give it a good test so you guys can see if you are active tracking yourself <clears throat> on a moped, whether it will work or not. So yeah, let's get into the screen recording. Alrighty, so we have active track turned on and as I get onto the moped, hopefully it will track me. So this um, little annoying things popped up into the middle of the screen, but I'll remove that in post by just putting the HD preview up. But we'll see if it tracks. Um, actually, it might go away if we just wait two seconds. So it's got me and I will just move up a little bit so we can try and avoid the trees. There we go. All right, and then we're gonna start moving forward on the moped and see if it'll track us through here. So here we go, taking off to begin with. So it's got a tree to dodge. So we'll see how it goes around that. All good so far. I'm gonna pick up a bit more speed now. We'll see how it goes. So we're going very fast through here, as you can see. And it seems to be tracking up. Oh. There we go, it's lost me there. Okay, so I may have taken off a bit too fast for it. So I'm gonna go up a bit and we'll try and find again. We'll try and get it to track us again. Might get a bit closer. There we go, active track, go, okay. So it's back on us, we'll try again, and hopefully there's no more potholes. I hit a few potholes, so again, I'll just, I'll slowly start again. It's gonna be interesting when I go under this little shade, if it's, yeah, it's still got me, all right. Now I'm gonna pick up a bit more speed here and overtake Joel and see how we go. So still got me good. Um, traveling at a solid speed now. A lot of bumps up ahead, so I'm gonna have to slow down. But the drone seeming as if, as I go under these trees, as if it has still maybe got me. We'll see. Oh. No, there we go, it's lost me again. So with a lot of obstacles, if you do want to watch my other active track video, it actually lost me right there as well. But with a bit more of an open area up ahead here, we'll see if it does do any better. Alrighty, so I okay, so I've lined it up here now for a parallel track. It's got me active track parallel i'm gonna click and hit go so we'll see how this one goes oh it's lost it again i think you have to be quite a bit closer with these parallel tracks okay active track parallel go okay working recording here we go let's see how this tracks along here i'm gonna go pretty slow at the start and we'll pick up speed if it ends up doing all right so traveling along here now on the moped at 10k, just cruising, it's pretty bumpy, so couldn't go much faster even if I wanted to. Um, let get a bit more speed up through here. It's still got me all right, just watching out for these trees. So this is doing pretty well along here with the sideways tracking mode as I go past that pole it's still got me all right got some trees up here it's dodged them so that's all good it is gaining altitude by the way we are going uphill uh, I might just take off a bit faster here and see how we go there's a tree there just watching to make sure that it doesn't hit anything as I take off a bit faster here it is struggling to keep up a little bit but here we go I'm picking up a lot more speed here and it, oh, a big tree is coming. Oh, and it just missed that tree. That was deadly. But it has still found me over here. So let's see. Tap, active track, parallel. 
and and we'll see if it can oh see it's still got me there okay we'll keep going and we'll see if this wait active track parallel go i think it needs to be a bit closer again so i was pretty impressed with that until it got really close to that tree and had to dodge it is when it um lost us so we'll hit there so we'll go up to the end of this road and see see if we can if it can get us at least to there pretty happy with this like if you're on an open road you will have absolutely no issues with this let's see if it'll stay on me through here and it has okay so now what i'm going to do is just track from above and try and find a more open road and represent what that would be like this big open road and we're going to try and track along it so as you can see me right here i'm going to lower a bit and move up here a little bit active track go start recording i am shooting in um d uh d log or d cine like um and i'll do color grading and post so you can see some 4k raw footage as well but here we go open road um, and we'll see how it, she goes along here. So I'm going to take off quick right to begin with. It's following along nicely as I hit a ton of bumps on this. So as you can see, an open road. And this little, little guy does it really well. I'll just go up here and then I'll lap around. Um, in fact, I might try and go try and do a quick turn around here and then see if it'll spin around and keep following so as I go under holy and it no it lost me okay so oh my god it's got me again well that is impressive <laughs> what a surprise um, and yeah, I'll take off again up here and congratulations DJI, that was amazing. I didn't even touch anything and it got back on me. So that is pretty cool. And you know what, I'm gonna just go, like look at this tracking on this open road. You can just get some pretty cool shots by yourself doing this. Um, I'm super stoked. I hope you're stoked with the video. If you are, definitely, oh, sorry, it's so bumpy. Definitely like and subscribe. I'm gonna go through here. Hopefully it doesn't hit a tree. Should be right, I trust it's obstacle avoidance. And I'll stop right here. And yeah, I hope you liked it, the video. Um, if you did, give us a thumbs up and um, we'll see you next time. Waiting for the time to pass me by.